Yep, there's oh, okay. your chest. I was oh, just sorting through my inventory. <laughs> There was one more thing I wanted to ask you. Maybe we could show our viewers also. You are not wearing a jetpack. You cheater. Nope. Hacks. <laughs> no, he's not hacking. Um, there's a mod. And do you know the name of the mod, Jake? Uh, Advanced Genetics. So here's the advanced genetics page. It looks like it's just one page. And he's got something to do with genes that he can change. Uh, well, you explain it better than I can. <laughs> Go ahead and explain it. Okay, so first off, you need to scrape any kind of animal and just get yourself through all the machines. And then you take a syringe of your own blood, which you just make a syringe and like right click and you'll get some blood then you synthesize it and you'll get like synthesized blood or something like that and then you create a gene get it completed by adding other like a basic gene to that gene to build it up and then you just take that gene and the syringe of blood and combine them and then you'll get a filled syringe and then you synthesize it again and then you can inject yourself um do you mean in real life? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yes, in real life. <laughs> All right. Can you show us a demonstration? Can you give me one of those syringes? Yeah, I'll just have to run to my base. All right. We're going to cut away, and then we'll bring you to his base. Okay, I'm going to go get started on that gene. Now, does it have to be your blood or my blood, or does it matter? It doesn't matter. Okay. DNA analyzer. This is crazy stuff, man. This looks like the Matrix. I need to go find a bat. A bat? I saw one in your... Uh, oh, I got plenty of bats. Yeah, that. yeah, I got plenty. But let me ask you, what do you do with a bat? Do you syringe them? or what? You scrape them with that. You'll get skin cells. Scraper. If you want to do this with me, you can. Yeah, sure. Maybe you can just keep that. All right, thanks. All right, let's go over to your place. All right. Well, Still don't see any bats. Yeah, maybe we should go to a cave somewhere. Yeah, there's a uh, ravine right beside my house. That's where I usually find my bats. So all you're gonna do is just hit the bat with it, and then some. You right click. And an indicator will show up that you you're complete somehow. Well, you right click it and you get the skin cells and it just drops like an ordinary item if you were to throw it on the ground. Okay. I went out the front doors. Um, at the front door now. Okay. Okay, I found a bat. I just right click it. And it throws out C. Were you able to hit him? Yeah, I got a few. Okay, great. I'll meet you upstairs. Okay.
Oh, I found some bats. I'm gonna try it here. Okay. He's just standing in place. Is that normal? Oh, yeah, there's the seeds. Yeah. Cool. Dude, I filled up my inventory with it. <laughs> yeah, you get quite a few of them. Alright, uh, well, my potion of uh, night vision has worn out, so I yeah, can find my way hard. back up. Right. And I'll just take all of the the little skin cells you found and put it in that iron chest. If you want to empty your inventory really fast, you, know, you can shift space left click, right? I did, and it came back to me, so I just did it manually. Oh, okay. But now, this only... chest feeds into the DNA analyzer, and from there you get the cell. Then it moves over to the extractor, which extracts it into a helix. Helix comes to the decryptor. Look, you see on that helix how it says fly? Yeah. That's what we're looking for. So now okay. you want to take this, that helix you have, and put it in this DNA splitter. Then choose the gene fly. Go ahead and take it out. And put it in the next machine over. Okay, now you want to come back to this first diamond chest. And you see how there's a lot of basic genes in there? Yeah. Start taking those basic genes and putting them through the DNA splitter. How many do I need? Uh, 28. Alright, so I put it inside which one? The second box? The DNA splitter. Just make sure this power bar stays closer to the top. Because it kind of gets buggy sometimes. So I go ahead and choose basic. Then take that out. Go ahead and put another one in and just keep doing that. So they don't stack? No. Okay, now once you get quite a few of those, go ahead and start putting them through the breeder. Could have recorded this, but... I'm recording. Oh, you are? Okay. Um, it doesn't take into the breeder. Those are basic right? Yeah, it is a basic. Or is it because there is a gene fly in there already? Uh, just let me see one of the little deals you got out of the breeder. Oh, you'll want to put in the actual little balls you got. What was that? I'm sorry? The little genes that say basic beside them that look like the fly gene. Right. Go ahead and put those in here. See how it's kind of freaking out? Yeet. There's so many overclockers, you just kind of have to wait for it to get back up to the top. Okay. Alright, I'm out. Alrighty, I'm getting you some more. Go ahead and start running those through. You got six more, right? Uh, three more. I got two more. 
Uh, we're gonna need three more. Three more? Yeah. So this is a little bit of a process. It, it's easy enough to do, but it just takes a little while to do. Yeah, it takes a little time. I used my last fly complete gene last time I fought a litter. All right, see how it says completed? Yeah. Already go ahead and take that out. And... Go ahead and put it in the combiner. Ah, there's the syringe. Needs to be centrifuged first. Okay, now you see it's combining. Uh huh. Now it says syringe filled. Yep. Now go ahead and put it back in the centrifuge. Now take that and inject yourself. That's a really good effect when you do that. Alright, you can go ahead and let go. Now take your jetpack off and see if you can fly. There it is. I am floating. I am a fly there on a go. wall. <laughs> and I got germs all over me. <laughs> cool. Thank you, man. Welcome. Just that simple. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty simple. It's just a long process, though. Yep. I'm going to leave the syringe in this box. And I'm going to make my way back. But I think I'm going to call it quits for this episode. I want to thank you for watching. And I'll catch you all later.